Six-month-old Bobby Cerigliano died in the crib his parents thought would keep him safe. The boy from Long Island died when the side rail of his dropside crib slid off the tracks and trapped his head and neck between the mattress and the malfunctioning side rail. The boy suffocated as his face was pressed against the mattress. The Consumer Product Safety Commission says 32 infants or toddlers have died in dropside cribs in the last decade. The same type of crib may have caused at least 14 other deaths. The CPSC has pledged action, but New York Senator Kirsten Gillibrand will introduce a bill this week to outlaw the manufacture, sale, or resale of all dropside cribs. They would also be banned from daycare centers and hotels. More than 7 million dropside cribs have been recalled in the last five years. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.